I'm going to show and tell you all about the best, most compact CPAP system for off-grid camping. Like you, I have sleep apnea and I have to use a CPAP machine at night to stay alive. When I go camping, my new, complete, self-contained, no electricity needed CPAP system fits in this little box. This is all of it. Before, for a camping trip, or just a weekend camping trip, this is what I had to bring along. A typical, very popular CPAP machine and a portable battery unit. And this has always worked fine, but as you can see, it's very big and bulky and heavy. I'm definitely not gonna take this on a backpacking trip. So, our adventures have been limited to camping out of our vehicle or camping trailer. This is a great power unit, by the way. I'll put a link to it down in the video description. Believe it or not, this is a fully functional CPAP machine with its own power supply. I know, I was a little skeptical at first too, but I've been using it every night for the past three weeks, testing it. And let me tell you, it performs every bit as good as my larger unit. This is ResMed Air Mini from a company called Lufta, or Lofta, however you pronounce that. It required a prescription from my doctor and it's set up to all my requirements. First thing you probably noticed is its lack of a humidifier water tank. This has a unique way of not needing one. I'll get to that in a minute. At the air intake, there's a replaceable filter behind this little panel right there. The hose hooks up here, clicks in, and the power cord plugs in right there. Power button right there. It also comes with an AC power cord just in case you're around electricity, like in a motel room or something. And like most everything else, this is Bluetooth to an app on my phone, and this will give me all of the stats. Most importantly, for the past 30 years, I've had a Class A CDL driver's license. Federal law requires that I take an annual physical and get certified that I'm in good health and can safely operate a big truck. At that time, I have to provide proof that I'm using a CPAP device nightly and this will provide that needed information. That's a big thing for many of us. This little battery unit is all that's needed to power it. I was able to get two full nights of sleep out of this thing. It is a Metastrom Pilot 24 Lite. On the end, there's a power button, the little blue light to show you that it's on, and four power indicator lights. Oh, and a port to charge a phone. This comes with the off-grid package that you can get through Lufta, Lofta. Now there's a couple of ways of recharging this. One is they provide the short cord, plugs in, and then take the AC cord for the CPAP, and that plugs into there, like, like this. Yeah, man. And then just plug it into the wall. Another way is to take another short little cord that they give you, plug it in, and then this end will go into a power unit like this. And I'm sure you can get an adapter from here down to like uh, the 12 volt port in your car too. Now my experience has been with recharging is through this cord plugged into a 12 volt power unit like this takes a little under three hours. Using this cord plugged into a 110 wall outlet takes about two and a half to bring this battery from completely dead up to 100%. Now here is another very important part of the off-grid package that Lufta puts together. It's a compact solar panel made to recharge your power unit during the day. It has a built-in solar controller that is perfectly compatible with the battery unit. All you do, take that supplied cord, plug it in here, plug it into the battery pack, and it's recharging. 
There's also a longer cord that you can store in this little pouch in it, and that will get you a little further away from the solar panel with this. Now I haven't had a chance to use the solar panel to fully charge this battery from dead to, uh, to full, but I would imagine you lay this out on a picnic table uh, in the sunlight, even somewhat hazy sunlight, and within, you know, four, six hours, this should be fully charged up. I'm guessing. So these three components will allow me to stay out in the middle of nowhere indefinitely and be small enough to pack and light enough to carry. Lufta also offers the usual hose, headgear, and masks. I use a full face one. Now back to how this unit humidifies the air that you're breathing in. This replaceable porous disc in the mask collects the moisture from your exhale. And that moisture is released when you breathe in. Basically, just recycling your own body's water vapor. Again, I was skeptical of this, but it definitely works. This is the solar panel that I use to recharge this large unit. So, I went from this big, bulky, heavy system here to this right here. A fraction of the bulk and weight and works every bit as good as my old system. Am I happy with it? Absolutely. Would I recommend it? Definitely yes. I put a link to it down in the video description. Now if you don't mind carrying some bulk and weight, this power unit, I haven't tried it out yet, but this is like 95 amp hours, and it would power this little thing for I'm guessing a week, maybe even more, without having to recharge this. I put a link to this and a code to get, I think 10% off, something like that, down in the video description as well. As always, thanks for watching, and I hope you consider subscribing to our channel. And hit that like button if you like this video.